Hey guys, what's up? This is Naini here from Techbatic Solutions and today we are going to talk about a new website which is known as Jumpshare. Now as the name suggests, Jumpshare allows you to share files of almost any type with almost anyone in the world. There is no signups and logins required and it supports 150 plus formats of files. So on my desktop I've got 9 files and they are all of different file extensions. So I'm going to upload and test it out and I'll show you the features of uh, jumpshare.com so let's proceed so this is jumpshare.com and you can see it's in beta state it's written on the top and uh, basically you just need to select the files to share so let's say I will upload these files and there we go click on open and all the files will start uploading the uploading is really fast and on the top we have a share link now this is the link that you need to share with anyone whom you want these files to be shared with you can email it or you can use any social media platform to share these files. Now Facebook, Twitter and Google Plus are given with icons on this website. And we have a send us feedback option on the top and upload more, more files. At the bottom like this particular website and follow jumpshare.com. And you can see at the one, uh, one more thing at the bottom is that these files will automatically expire after 14 days. So there is a 14 day time limit for your files to be on this server so that's uh, I think that's a nice feature because not everyone will actually want these files to be there on the website itself because they would want them to get deleted and uh, this website deletes it for you automatically but there's a drawback on this side also because many people also want the files to be there online so let me tell you it's very difficult for these websites because they require a lot of hosting and getting that much amount of space is not so easy so according to me giving a 14 day time limit is pretty good pretty good compared to other websites it's not as good but just think about the benefit because you're getting to see the preview of the files if i click on any file let's say fiveicon.psd which i just uploaded you can see i can preview it and uh, i can then download i can post it somewhere like facebook somewhere or something like that copy the link of this uh, particular file email it or download it now the mp3 player works on actually this website as a whole works on all the mobile devices I tried it on tablets mobiles like iPhone Android Windows phone etc and it worked perfectly fine there's no glitches the only problem is I wasn't able to download the get the files to get downloaded so that was one problem and the best part is I can view videos and you know uh, the, I can actually listen to the music like the mp3 player which we have got it will work perfectly fine on your mobile phone so I'm just trying to give you a preview on that you can actually preview these files and then we have the iPhone 5 iPhone 5 doc which I just made so you can see it works perfectly fine another thing that I noticed was on the mobile phones was the problem was since the mobile phones don't have that great hardware I'm not talking about the best phones I'm talking about the lower end phones they might lag when you're uh, moving up and down in the pages while you're browsing files like PDF pages or text files etc and you can see it also runs EPUB you can actually read the EPUB file another good thing of this website is you can actually use this website to actually preview files just upload it and if you want you if you want to uh, preview a PSD file you can just pre preview it so that's uh, something really nice I have also tried uploading videos it works perfectly fine and uh, another good thing is let's say I just uploaded nine files and you wanted to share more five six files more and you wanted to uh, share uh, more the other five six files again in the along with these nine files so what you need to do is just click this URL visit this URL and just click on your uh, upload once again and select the file that you want to upload so let's say I want to upload proxy as fiveicon.png you can see it gets uploaded along with these files now let's say I want to upload other files separately so I'll just go to jumpshare.com and now I will upload the file let's say again the same file you can see I get a new URL and it gets uploaded separately so that's exactly about this website and you can contact this website you like it so that's a really nice website I love this website 
share your files guys i hope you like this video guys please rate comment subscribe and visit techbarack.com